Hello and welcome back, fellas. Try we're trying total party kill. I saw this on uh, I saw this on Twitter and it looks cute as heck and it's uh, super cheap. How much is it? I should always I should always find these things out first, huh? Uh, this game is so it was six fifty Canadian, so it's probably about a dollar fifty. I don't know, but uh, anyway, you you be the judge. But uh, it looks really cool. It's a kind of a puzzle game. It reminded me a little bit of a game I played a long time ago called The Lost Vikings which uh, I wouldn't mind doing a, a playthrough at some point, but uh, I don't think anyone would really care for that. But either way, uh, you have these three characters and you're going to be solving puzzles and um, unlocking doors and stuff by basically killing them. They, they're going to die. They, they, they will be dying. So we are switching um, with A and S. Can they all jump? They can all jump. That's that's my Lost Vikings uh, knowledge or coming into to to be a pain. So uh, we're getting to the end here. If any of them get to the end, then I guess we win. I am playing blind here, so you'll have to forgive me. So we can uh, we we do want to kill. Do we want to kill? Kill. All right. So we we kill our our other party members in order to solve puzzles. Um, the wizard can. Freeze his uh, friends, and that's pretty cool. And <laughs> he's he's still dead. And the archer is a hundred percent paying all of the prices here, except now. Now he gets a little bit of revenge. Oh dang! Okay, so he can make little platforms. That's cute as a button. And now we know all of the cool uh, details. So um, it looks like the arrow doesn't work if uh, if you don't have a corpse to go through it okay so let's um let's get ourselves a corpse uh can we jump on top we can we can jump on top of each other okay that's a another uh feature that i didn't know about let's see can we jump jump down no we can't go down through platforms it's not like literally every single other platformers like press down and jump have you ever noticed like how often you're told like you never you never told that you can jump on enemies to kill them. Whoops. Oh, I'm gonna have to probably restart. I don't know how to restart. You're never told you can uh, you can jump on enemies to kill them because it's almost a universal like universally understood thing. But you are told that you can jump down through platforms by pressing down and jump. It just seems like a thing that I've seen so often. All right. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna jump and kill our mage here. And then, uh, well, I'm a little bit concerned here. Ah, uh, yeah, you know what? I was about to, I was about to mess that up because we want to do the same thing on the other side. There we go. Good job, you did it. All right, now we have a new, new puzzle, new, new puzzle. Who dis? Looks to me like we are solving this much the same as we solved the other one, except this time it's the archer that's doing, doing the dirty work. All right, and there we go. Nothing too complicated so far. I'm sure things will get a little bit complicated once we have uh, to solve the puzzle with various different um, abilities and not just the one. So yeah, uh, just immediately, this this seems like a nightmare. Um, seems to me I'm gonna wanna kill the warrior because I'm gonna need the archer. So we're gonna go ahead and freeze the warrior and drop them down like that. And the, hmm, did I mess that up already? It's one of those games, isn't it? Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna drop down with both of them and boom. And I don't know if I can make that jump. I'm a little, yeah, okay. So that's kind of a problem. Mm, you know what? I, I, this is, we, we just wanna, we, we just wanna solve this one with the mage. We only need the mage for this one. So we're gonna freeze this guy and we're gonna throw him down there and then we're gonna come over here and we're gonna do the same to our archer friend and this is again this is just a uh, oh my god really okay i don't know if i should be getting hit by those spikes that seems like a kind of a hit detection problem or hit hitbox problem you know but uh, you know if I'll, I'll be a bit more careful here we go all right don't 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 jump max don't max jump all right so far so good so now what are we doing here 
you know what I think? I think that we're going to be um, using both the ice block and the warrior. So we're going to we're going to freeze our friend here, Mr. 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 Archer, and then we're going to Hiya. Yeah, that's that's actually not working as, as well as I'd hoped. All right. Well, OK, that so maybe maybe the other way around. So we, we use the archer instead. Um, yeah, that looks better. That's good. OK, so now we're we're learning a thing or two about how we can combine abilities to solve puzzles. All right, this is interesting. Um, I think I need an ice block. Yeah, I need an ice block. So we're gonna. Oh. Uh, okay, I, I need to. Uh, I need to get that ice block through him. I think if I give it a bit more of a of a push, then then uh, you know it would have been better. Let me see here. And then you also have to just like completely disregard all um, safety here. And now, there we go. Nice. Things are getting a bit spicier. And I just got an Achievo. Ten, ten puzzles solved already. Wow. Um, so this is interesting. I wonder if we can shoot the button without killing anyone. No. Uh, interesting. Okay, so let's... Um, you know, sometimes you gotta solve, you gotta, you gotta try the puzzle once without, um, and then the intention of like solving it. So we're gonna, we're gonna hit that button, and then we're gonna jump down. Obviously, I can't jump down all the way, which is kind of a problem. Um, how would we go about doing this? Obviously, we can't do something like that. Can we freeze it? We can freeze him after. But the problem is now, what, how do we, can we, can we freeze this body as well? Yes, we can. Oh, it's maybe. Well, outside of, uh, you know, some, some interesting puzzles uh, that I, or mechanics that I've just discovered, that was, that was actually going pretty well. Um, all right, let's try that again. I, I think this game is definitely probably better played on a uh, controller. Now, how do I want to do this? Let's do that. Oh God. Okay. This is going to be, this is going to be tricky in it. In it. Tuesday. All right. Sorry. Um, all right. So let's, let's, um, not sure how I want to do this. How do I want to do this? I think the way I did it before was actually not terrible. Okay, that's there we go. Uh, there we go. I mean, I don't know if that's the way you're supposed to solve it, but I solved it. So maybe, you know, any method that works is a, is a working method. You know what I mean? Now, this is going to be tricky. Hmm. It seems to me I need two ice blocks over there. Um, I'm wondering. I did not mean to do that. Okay, well that's pretty fun. Um, all right. Well, what I what I want to do here is I want to um, use the archer, shoot them across there. And we're gonna we're gonna then freeze that body. I keep pressing the wrong buttons because this game is not keyboard friendly at all. Like the these buttons are not intuitive to me. Um, all right, so that is fine. But the problem is, is what do you do next? Um, I guess what we do is we get both of these guys over here. Can we both fit on the block? I don't think we can. Hmm. Hmm. I think I think what I need to do is freeze the archer here and then push them through. I, I should have been a bit more aggressive about it. I actually I don't know if that was that would have done it. Hmm. 
Oh, you know what? I've got it. I figured it out. Okay, hold on. So first we gotta we gotta freeze this lad here. No, that's that's actually incorrect. Hold on. It's, sorry, I do actually have it. I just need to get it in the right order here. So what we need to do first is we need to get our archer. Mr. Archer, come over here. Shoot him across. Then we freeze him. Then um, we can just kill the archer over here and uh, push them down. There we go. So now we just have to be really careful about that jump and we're good. Game also kind of reminds me of a scapegoat. A scapegoat was uh, is quite a good game. I, I like it a lot, actually. It's one of my favorite little puzzle platformers. Um, and uh, yeah, it's got this same kind of vibe of like really clever um, little one-off puzzles. Okay, so we're gonna do that. Um, so I'm wondering if the lesson here is that we can stack corpses. No, actually, interesting. That is interesting. And I can't make this jump, I'm assuming. Um, how do we reset? Okay, uh, I need, I need better buttons. I need like a quick restart button. Okay, so, hmm. Well, we definitely, um, we definitely want to do that at least once, right? So I'm wondering if maybe we just step on them. No, that doesn't really work either. Oh, you know what? Oh, I get it. I get it. Clever. Okay, that's clever. We're going to extend it from the other side. There we go. I, I like that. That's a that's a, actually a pretty crafty puzzle there. All right, things are continuing to get spicy. Um, I'm wondering if uh, we're finally we, we finally have a puzzle here that the warrior can solve Doesn't doesn't seem like it to be honest um, Let me let me try Getting over here I mean maybe uh, Not really Yeah, I don't know it seems like a lot of puzzles are solved with the um the 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 archer and the wizard so i'm wondering how what i guess okay you know what we got to do i i get it it's this is this is actually a pretty easy one so we're gonna freeze this body i guess i could have stood uh, stood on the warrior and done much the same uh and now we're gonna get the warrior over here and yeah we're just gonna jump him over and then we're gonna freeze his body as well and that's that's that fairly easy one this one should have uh, maybe come before uh, some of the other puzzles um hmm okay well we're definitely using the archer for this i think this might be our first warrior win well not first but you know what i mean um so the first thing we're gonna do is we're probably gonna kill the wizard first so let's get over here and kill that then we're gonna jump over here as the archer and we're gonna we're gonna slash him over on the button. There we go. Fun fun little puzzle game. I, I I'm appreciating it. Um, this is an interesting puzzle. How would one get to that button way over there? Oh, I get it. I get it. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna. Um, get our yeah, there we go, and then we're just gonna freeze them There we go easy Two survivors um, All right, so this time we have buttons above us I'm assuming we need to push both of these buttons um, Hmm Interesting. Seems to me we're almost, we're, we're cl all, very close to being able to just jump into it. 
Um, can't slash it. Okay. So, we need a third body. We need a third body. Um... Hmm. Yeah, this one's got me kind of stumped, I won't lie. Because, like, uh, I could, like, bring the wizard over to this side. Right? I could bring the... Oh, wait a minute. Uh, I, I, I... It's just something... Something interesting has occurred. Hold on. Hold on, let's do it the other way around. This is probably not how we solve this, but I'm going to try it anyway. Okay, it doesn't really let you get away with it. I was wondering, like, okay, let's, you know, like, let's uh, jump with one and then the other. It doesn't really... I, I think killing killing your party members is how we solve puzzles in this game. We're not going to be cheesing anything. But, you know, I, I like to try these things. Um, let's just try something. I don't know. Okay, I guess the, the body... Ooh, didn't mean to do that. Okay, I got it. I got it. Easy. It's actually it's that so like I think the 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 thing that had me confused about this one is um why why should the block of ice be any better than than standing on your your member's head. I guess the block is slightly higher, but I think that's that's not as clever of a puzzle honestly in some ways. Um okay, so this is going to be interesting maybe. Oh, you know what? I kind of want to try something stupid here. What else is new, right? Um, let's let's do something like this. Oh, I wonder if this works. No. Okay, I was wondering if like maybe they would like fly across, like fly across <laughs> on the magic, the magic dead warrior carpet. That would have been pretty good. Um. Hmm. I feel like uh, we need a stepping stone and also maybe a uh, a dead body on the other side, like via um, an arrow. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with the arrow. Uh, that's not really what I wanted, actually. I don't know why I thought that that was going to work. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to freeze this lad and then we're going to slash him across like that. I mean, that's that's pretty good. And then we're going to I don't know if we need to even kill both, but I'm going to do so for safety purposes. And can we make this jump? Oh, yes, just barely. All right. So I, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna solve 20 puzzles. I, I don't know like how you know how many puzzles are in this game in total, but that seems like a good number. Um, okay, this is an interesting one. Thinking we're just gonna I'm just gonna jump them over, and then we're gonna freeze that body, and then. Can I, can I push that over? I, I should have just like done this properly, but it's fine. I'm going to push them over like that. And then um, we need a body to stand on. Easy enough. Okay. All right. Um, so, oh, all right. This is the 20th puzzle. I'll, I'll solve, I'll solve the 20th puzzle. Um... This is gonna feel kind of like the same puzzle as I did last time. Um, I need I need a, a both a stepping stone and a. Okay, I think I've got it. I think I've got it. Um, tricky. Okay, so what we're gonna do first of all is we're gonna. Um, 
again I'm, I'm trying to press the right buttons here we're gonna hit throw him over and then we're gonna freeze him so he falls down this is good and then we're gonna jump over as far as we can with the archer and freeze them I don't think I can make this jump I don't well, I guess we'll never know now okay here's a question this is an interesting question you know what ah ah, ah. okay we're gonna we're gonna freeze the knight here and then we're gonna jump on this is my flying carpet ride again but this time it makes a bit more sense yeah that's pretty cool actually I like that a lot all right we'll have a quick peek at the ne next puzzle and then I'm gonna call it here because I don't want to give away too much of the of the game um it's not terribly expensive but uh yeah I really like the concept of this um it, it's well executed and um the puzzles are actually really clever without being like samey you know they, they're actually they're 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 well put together um but this is total party kill it's a it's a very small little puzzle game but I, I like it a lot um i hope you enjoyed this if you did hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this i'll see you guys next time take it easy